Hello everyone, it's time for another Scrollabox unboxing video. We'll see what the month of January brings us. Oh, we have a bullet sharpener. <laughs> I have one of those. They're really good. Anyway, it's a beautiful print by Layla. A cool little sketchbook by Sylvine. Sylvine? Sylvine. Probably 140 GSM, 40 pages, textured cartridge paper for all media. Has a nice uh, little tooth to it. Great little sketchbook to start the the new year. So. As we've always already seen, there's a bullet uh, sharpener, pencil sharpener. It's very heavy. Milk chocolate e eclair. Hmm, okay. We'll see. <laughs> Sticker as usual. Oh boy, I think I see things that I've already received. I don't know if it was in the same box or another one. Um, they are magic markers, twin tip, a pale olive and a crocus violet. And there's a fine bullet nib and a oof. oh my gosh if I can open it a chisel nib and a let's see Palomino Blackwing. I already have a couple of these. So this one is a 602. And um, <clears throat> adding 1800 Profi Pen. So it's a black fine liner. Oh, really fine. What's 0.1? Uh, light fast. Yeah, it's just as light fast. So let me see. I want to check something. Hold on a second. So I get these two. So this one is the same brand, and this one is by Kuratake. Um, but the Magic Marker brand, I don't know if it's this brand or this brand. Anyway, this one has a, an address in London, but it's made in Japan. So I wonder if it's the Kuretake brand that's distributing it in um, in England under a, an, a British brand. I'm not sure, but they really look exactly the same. So 
anyway not not a bad marker by the way but uh, at least there are different colors yay <laughs> anyway stick around I'll do some swatches and then I'll find something to draw so I checked in those markers yes the uh, extra one that I have I did receive it with another scroller box which is a bit of a bummer however it's a really good marker so uh, it's not too bad and again um, different colors so no big deal now what I really like with scroller box is that every so often they send a full-size sketchbook and it's usually a pretty good quality hey hi Holly Holly says hi uh, <laughs> anyway uh, this was this one was really nice too I really like the texture I was a bit worried about using the markers on this paper but it worked really well uh, I, I did put uh, an extra piece of paper uh, behind the sheet that I was using just because I knew it was going to go right through and also it it spread a little bit the ink spread a bit on the on the paper but once I figured it out uh, near the edges I went a bit lighter on the paper and so the the ink didn't spread as much and didn't go over the lines as it did earlier when I applied it um, I really like that green oh my gosh it's so pretty and it, it kind of to me it looks like gold um, so that's why I ended up uh, making a big star eventually but anyway it was a fun challenge um, the uh, Palomino is really nice I like that too it's dark and it's um, it has a nice range the only thing that I don't like is that it's it's very easy to smudge uh, the eraser, eh, I didn't find that it erased that well. I don't know if it's a combination of the um, the dark pencil on this particular paper. I'm not sure, but I used, ended up finishing the erasing with a kneaded eraser. That, that worked much better. The fine liner is really nice too. I know I'm saying it's nice, it's nice, but it's really, it's true. I liked that it was a zero one because it was very fine and I was able to work on the details really well but the ink flow is is very smooth and uh, I really enjoyed using it so all in all fun box too bad we get the same uh, markers as we have before but again they're good markers and I didn't get uh, a color I already had so that's okay thank you everyone for watching hope you like this video uh, subscribe if you want to see more I'll see you later bye bye